Oh, greetings everyone to another Forza benchmarking video and for today we have a newest one Forza Horizon 5 and first section is going to be a benchmark mode but before that I'll show you the settings I used and looking at the settings as you can see everything is maxed out I used 4x MSA as always and as you can see I didn't use FXA because it's just different anti-aliasing technique so it just doesn't make any sense to use both of them because FXA is just way way worse quality compared to MSA so anyway let's get to the benchmark Now as you can see with these settings it drops below 60 fps so if I wanted a little bit smoother experience I would just turn off MSA or turn it to 2x instead of 4x so but it's really not an issue at least for me. Maybe some people would prefer a high refresh rate then yeah sure few settings should be reduced but for me it's just not an issue. Now if you look at the results of this benchmark, you can see that there is one stutter count and in general it's just pretty smooth experience I would say. As you can see the bottleneck is obviously the GPU in this case and CPU could render way more frames than this one but yeah it's just very demanding from GPU this time. And jumping to free row mode. I just wanted to show you the most demanding scene from CPU as far as I know and in general it's still really not that demanding from CPU I would say but make sure you have at least 8 CPU threads because if you have older i5s without hyper threading or SMT it will struggle and you will see stutters and sometimes the world will pause for a second or some other scenes won't render for some time so there will be some issues for quad core CPUs without hyper threading so yeah it's just in these times it's 8 threads minimal I would say for newest games. And for the last part of this video, I wanted to show a few normal races that I did, so here it is. And also I just wanted to say that I'm so glad that this game doesn't have same problem that Forza Horizon 4 had with my MSI River Tuner statistic server. And in that game it just was blocked because of anti-cheat system and this game doesn't have that issue so I can finally use normal game version and it just works perfectly. And yeah to summarize this game is really good. I personally prefer Forza Motorsport series but to each of their own of course. But also if you notice poor video quality I'm really sorry about that because I'm using a little bit slower bandwidth to save the performance for the main game and in these games Nvidia Shadow Play just deals 
pretty poorly because the scene is changing very fast and it needs a lot of bandwidth to deal with that and yeah it just it might look a little bit pixelated so yeah sorry about that of course i could crank up the bandwidth but it would eat fps and i just really don't want that <laughs> And for now I'm leaving you with the gameplay. As always, thank you very much for your comments, support, likes and all those things and just I really appreciate you watching my videos so thank you as always for watching and see you next time.